Hi, Tina Thorburn here from the Highways team with another update on the work taking place on Surrey's roads. Next Thursday we'll be in Leatherhead for the first of two nights of resurfacing work. It will be taking place at the junction between Church Road and High Street and is being done as part of the Transform Leatherhead project to improve the town centre. The work will be done from 8 p.m. to 6 a.m. to keep disruption to a minimum, but it will mean that the Church Street car park can't be used between those times. There will be pedestrian access though and businesses will be open as normal. We thank them for their cooperation. Resurfacing the road over Hampton Court Bridge finished a few weeks ago and we now need to clean the stone and brickwork. This will involve steam cleaning in sections and it will take place from the 2nd of November for six weeks. This won't affect traffic and pedestrians will still be able to use the bridge, although parts will be fenced off. Our drainage scheme at Outward Lane in Chipstead continues to progress well. Work got underway at the start of October with the aim of reducing the chances of flooding, but there have been a few problems with drivers using Stagbury Avenue as an unofficial diversion route to Hazelwood Lane. So until Sunday, there will be a barrier at one end to keep the workers and residents safe. We're on track with our scheme in Epsom to help reduce congestion and improve the town centre's appearance, despite the recent fire at the Playhouse Theatre. Work to replace pavements and curbs in South Street is going well, and while we're doing everything to minimise disruption, we continue to thank everyone for their patience. Good pro progress is also being made with our Runnymede Roundabout project to reduce congestion. Various parts of the roundabout are being dug up so we can set up the traffic lights for motorists and pedestrians to cross safely, while next month electricity cables will be buried 10 feet underground. That's all for now. I'll be back with another update shortly.